Oh, what a finesse. What out. style. What perfection. What a hammer blow. Great pass! Textbook stuff! Whoa! Great catch! The ball stuck to his fingers like a fly sticks to a Thanks, piece of... Thanks, Jim, for that detailed analysis! Doesn't look like he'll be getting back on his feet too soon. He should be up before next week's match. Someone has just passed me some surprising news. Jordel Freshman has out. just been intercepted by a dwarf. What? Uh, oh, sorry. I got the two lines mixed up. That did sound a little unbelievable. What violence! Yes! It's a great spectacle, Bob! Mm. Mm. Poetry in motion! What we'd like to see... More, more often! often. Just a few yards to go. Yippee, yes. yippee, 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 Touchdown! Yippee! Good news for the fans. That first touchdown means that the teams won't be settling for a boring nil-nil draw. Today's insight comes from Jaime Schnivel, coach and owner of the Goblin Lowdown Rats team. In yesterday's Spike magazine, he said that Blood Bowl was like war. No winners, just survivors. Oh, now that's deep. About as deep as his team's position in the rankings. Charge! Don't hit me, don't hit me. Uh, oops, I'm sorry, that's an old reflex on this story. The player gets hold of the ball. I wouldn't be coming back in a hurry. Now there's an acrobat. Oh, extermination! Yes, it's nice to see an uppercut followed by a double backflip. <laughs> Fans. They're red hot. A majority of supporters reckon that the league should take measures to prevent the small minority of peaceful fans from watching a match from the terraces. They've got a point. If they don't want to join in the fun, they might as well stay home and watch it on cable vision. <clears throat> Looks like there was some bad blood between those two, eh, Bob? Yeah, Jim. Something to do with swapped body parts. Mm. 
And don't forget, children, don't try and do this at home. Remember, these are seasoned professionals. Well, one of them is anyway. Yes, splodge. Did you hear about the evil gits? The team that is made up of the mix of evil players? Their fans were the most evil supporters of the year award. Fully merited from what I've seen. Exterminated! Good job his nose got in the way. Yeah, otherwise he'd have got it full in the face. Exterminated! Oh, he'd have punched him straight into the infirmary. Ah, uh, don't worry, that's where he'll be waking up. He's got rid of the ball. or the jugular. Whatever it was, it was clinical. What the? The first half is over already. It can't be. Yep, they're heading back to the changing rooms. Well, I'll see you in a few minutes, boys. We're about to get started. No doubt they've been busy in the changing room with the needle and fray. Some of those injuries needed a rivet cut. We can congratulate the Junior Paragon Stink Team who have won the Junior Dungeon Bowl for the second year running. Well done, Spawners. And it's interesting to know that the names of several of these youngsters are already on the lips of many of the major team coaches. He made picking that ball up look easy. Punched him square in the face like a fly. Oh. Extermination! Wow. I can tell you straight, that hurts. Funny how his head went one way and the body the other. Uh, must have an elastic jaw. That reminds me of when I took Griff to bits in the 91 final against Reitland. Oh, yeah. You kneecapped him. Oh. 